My name is Nolly. Welcome to a new vlog and happy South By. Today is Friday, the first official day of South By Southwest. If you guys don't know what South By is, it's basically like a music, tech, film festival here in Austin, Texas. And honestly, there's so much more to it because brands just take the opportunity to have people, you know, in the same space. So really cool brands come and pop up here. I was lucky enough to get an invite to some really awesome events, so I'm definitely gonna take you guys along with me. Through tonight, which is Friday, I have three events, then tomorrow I have a full day of events, and then on Sunday I have a few. I'm currently trying on my outfits. I decided to do Rent the Runway again because I thought this was gonna be like the perfect chance to do it. I did it before COVID when they had the unlimited rentals, which was so nice, but they don't do that anymore, unfortunately. But I got this top from Rent the Runway. My first event is kind of, I don't even know what I would call it. They said dress party chic, and I have no idea what that means. But the flyer was black and red, so I kind of just went with the black. So I'm doing all black for the first event. And then tonight I'm meeting Miranda Kerr, and if you guys don't know who that is, she's a former Victoria's Secret model and she owns Cora Organics, which is a skincare company. They're known for their turmeric products and I love their exfoliant mask. So I wanted to dress more golden for that one. So here are a couple of my options. This is definitely, ooh, this is definitely number one. I think I could slay this and I think that color would look so good on me. Um, I got this pink dress. I don't know if it would like flatter my body as well, but just an option. And then this really cutesy top, but they said don't wear jeans. So I just don't know what bottoms I would wear with that. Actually, I could wear that top for the first event. I might ask what my boyfriend thinks because he literally is my stylist sometimes. Like I just need help and I feel like he knows me better Sometimes then I know myself, so, and he knows like what looks cool. So I got this watch on Amazon this week and it's perfect timing. It is so cute. I've been really wanting a rectangular um, watch and it's from the brand Bolova. And I went to go get some links taken out of it yesterday so it can fit perfectly and look how stunning it looks. I need to put my ring on, but the whole thing together looks so cute. Okay, so I need to figure out the other outfits. I'm kind of running out of time. <laughs> I already love this on me. Just hope it fits and zips. Okay. Oh. Please tell me why I'm drinking a Diet Coke to get more energy when I'm like already jittery and anxious. I don't know, <laughs> but I'm getting excited. Um, we don't know if we're gonna drive or just like Uber everywhere. It'd be ideal to drive because we have so many outfit changes We can just change in the car and obviously have our stuff in the car, but obviously Uber would be faster and our Events are so close together like they're pretty much overlapping each other So we're gonna just try to like book it to every event just to, like show face network a little bit It's gonna be chaotic, but in the best way my phone is dying I'm gonna have to go charge that really quick, but this is going to be the second event so Three outfits in total and the first one the black one I think I'm just gonna wear some kind of sneaker because we're probably gonna have to walk from where we're gonna park went to our first event and we just got changed in the car. We met Zero from Holes. 
Yes, and then we met Michael from Jane the Virgin. And they got a good picture. Yes, we need to do like a TikTok of like how many famous people we can meet at South yes, by. Because we also, were, we saw so many people that looked familiar, but we like couldn't put a finger on it. David Dobrik's best friend. Yeah. You said, like, or was. Yes. Ex like, best friend. Pre cancellation. <laughs> <laughs> and then yeah. so many TikTokers, like Zoe Fish or something like that. She's a dance dance TikToker. Yes. And then the girl that like ha sings like R and B songs and then mixes it to be like white people remixes at the club. Yes. She was there and she looked so super funny. cool. It it's wild she out did look here. Really cool. The yeah. dance floor was popping. I know it really was. I was sad to leave, but like, oh, it's five twenty one. We gotta get going. Okay. Well, I'm trying to vlog as much as I can on my phone and the little camera, so I'm trying it's to get It's the all the Olympics out here. It really we is. just changed in the car. It really is. All right, let's go to the next event. We're going to the Disney Parks event at the Commodore, which is super cool. Yes, let's Bye. go. All right, we're in downtown Austin at Commodore. I think that might Home be of the best bone marrow tacos ever. I'm really hoping they're there. We should take these off. Oh yeah, ready. maybe we should. <laughs> But we should keep them for scrapbooks or something. True. That'd be cute. Thank you. Hello. Hi there. <laughs> How are you? Nice to see you. Hi, Maria. Thank you. What about you two? event at the one and only Commodore Perry where the bougie people hang out. <laughs> we into our last event. This is with Cora Organics. We're gonna meet a Victoria's Secret model. <laughs> no big deal. No big deal. She's hot. I bought this in New York when I went and it's the coolest little phone tripod. Magnet. Ooh. Mag safe. We're gonna do an outfit of the day. And we're gonna pop up right here. Behind the scenes. Yes. <laughs> we're at our third and final event for Seth by for Friday because tomorrow is gonna be crazy. But here is our outfit of the day. So you wanna go first? Yeah. This shirt is from the brand Forward. Another one is rented off Rent the Runway. I'm not sure the brand, but how stunning is this? Love Gotta it. take some good pics. Um, jewelry is all the same. Oriana pretty much. And then same heels. Princess Polly. Okay, we'll be in there in like one minute. Okay, bye. We okay. have one minute to do a haul. We'll do a quick haul. <laughs> Let's go. Let's do it. Okay, All right. this is a party favorite bag for Core Organics event. All go. right, so we got this organic inside and out hat. Love this for the boat. Cute. Here's what it looks like on. <laughs> Casey, you need to know. Kourtney Kardashian, Lemmy Matcha. So excited Wee. for that. The Human Being Journal. This is so cute. cute. Dude, so this cute. is like a nice, she's thick. This is girthy. She's thick, she's thick. <laughs> All right, we got the Anastasia Brow and Rag Duo. Cute. Get the fuck out of the sun by Lauren Bostic. 
I actually, this is like, Megan and I went to this event when she launched this book. Yeah. This book is so good. Full Ooh. circle, now we have two. Not that I listen <laughs> to anything she said in it because I still call the sun, but like, you know. Definitely Same. we fry our skin. Um, we've got the Paul, Much Paul Mitchell Clean Beauty hair stuff. Love. And, oh, okay, okay. Hair repair. Okay. I'm like, what have you not done? <laughs> okay. The Cora. This is what the event was for, right? This is the, yes. This is the plant That's for last. stem cell retinol. Love alternative that. so it's not retinol but it's a retinol alternative it does all the same things that a retinol does but it's not retinol so it's not as harsh the one thing i took from her yeah. is that pregnant people can use it nice. yeah and also she looks like she's 25 and she's 40 so i will buy anything she puts that, out like, because if i can look that. like that at 40 years old yeah i'm sold so sold, sold, sold. sold. Okay. credit cards is that it Oh, this is... Uh, I did that She one. did that. Oh, yeah. That's okay. it? That's it. That's we're the good. haul. Okay, we're going to eat at oh, Salty Sal. What? You didn't the get slip. this. Oh. The slip. This is a silk pillowcase. This bitch is like $100. Wait. No, it's a sleep mask. Good night's rest. Okay, we tried to get in the Ludies, like at Comanore Berry. Obviously, they were booked, but we were trying to like do the lucky girl syndrome thing. Didn't work, but we got into Salty Sal. So work. let's go Salty eat because we're fucking hungry. Oh, sorry, this event food is like small as shit. I didn't need budget. anything from it, but I, I didn't also, need anything either. There was like cucumber roll. There was nothing. It looked like it was. Mm -hmm. Oh my god! Those men were knocking on our door. Like, oh. get out! Probably watching this vlog. <laughs> okay. and I know, literally. literally. <laughs> All right, anyway. let's go. So jiggly. Is it supposed to like? Good morning, y'all. It is day two of South by Southwest. It is Saturday, and yesterday I actually had the best day ever. Um, basically, we went to three events. You guys saw, I feel like I was pretty good at vlogging, so proud of myself for that. And on the way to the first event, when I was like going to pick up Amelia, I got the craziest email. Like, I. I was like shaking when I read it. Something on my list of manifestations is finally happening and I cannot wait to share more it's gonna happen like later this month so that was freaking crazy and then I was just seeing all my friends the whole day so like how can that not be like the best day um but it was just a really long day and it only started at like three we went to eat dinner because like honestly the event food is just so not sustainable <laughs> and we need some fuel in us so we got dinner at salty so and then i went home and got home at 11 30 and then stayed up to like one i think because i was like uploading photos and stuff but now i'm overwhelmed with the content i still haven't really posted yesterday's stories so i'm going to create and cultivate we're going to stand in line for like an hour i think so i'm hoping that i can you know post some stuff there like i said i have the best day ever but i also was just so like mentally drained and socially drained and hopefully a night of sleep is enough to recharge me for today because it's even like crazier today um so first we have create and cultivate like i said tanks is having a uh, panel there this morning so that'll be exciting to see her we have a shop style gifting suite which is so cool so like la and then um i'm trying to think maybe i should just like pull up my calendar okay we have a k18 hair event at alan's boots and then we have a tiktok party i tried to smuggle my way in and then we have a group love concert for today so very exciting very exciting stuff hopefully i'll have like pockets that i can like just chill and like be in silence maybe come home and do like an outfit change for sure for tonight because i feel like that concert it's also gonna be hot today but <laughs> that concert is not a blazer bag i'm carpooling with my friend shireen to the event i always get super self-conscious because honestly my car is not clean at all i told myself at the beginning of the year i need to keep it clean but you know what guys it just really hasn't happened i just took all my bags of clothes that was in my car literally since the beginning of the year to um uptown cheapskate got a little bit of money but there's just still so much shit in the trunk i don't know how it happens so. good morning good morning happy, oh south, by. happy south by happy south by we're at lanyana met up with kiana and of course shireen and i was also thinking like you wouldn't have enough hands for all our drinks oh yeah <laughs> there's no I was way imagining, like in and halfway in halfway in like yeah. the front <laughs> yes. um, but we saw the line and it wasn't like horrible outside of create and cultivate so Hopefully we'll get those good bags. The first one's in. What the heck? We got 
Look at how many goodie bags there are. There's a cute trucker hat. It's a big bag. Oh my gosh. Do we I have do? Walking into the next event with Shop Style, but it's not Shop Style anymore. It's Collective Voice. They literally just rebranded. Uh, and I think it's a gifting suite. We'll find out. Hey, I'm Kara, and we're here at the Collective Voice Open House for South by. Look at this cute little photo op, and we're about to head to the gifting suite. Yes, come upstairs. I'm so excited. I am disgusting because my face, I think I literally sweated off all of my makeup, so fun stuff. But I mean, both of those events that I just went to were so fun. So first off, we went to Create and Cultivate. And then second, we went to the shop style um, gifting suite kind of thing. It was not shop style anymore because they rebranded to Collective Voice. So I thought it'd be fun to show you guys what they gave us in both of the bags from both of the events. This one's fucking heavy. Um, if you were like the first 200 people in line for Create and Cultivate, you got a little goodie bag. It marked me 177. We were like just there. Um, but they emailed me beforehand and said that like I was able to go in a separate line for like media coverage. 
and then we ended up just like waiting in the line and i tried calling my contact and i was like hey is there a separate line like i don't see it the bouncer said he didn't know about it and so it was kind of like a last minute thing i think i mean honestly the whole south by southwest like everything about south by is last minute it seems because i feel like i was invited to events like what two days before they were supposed to happen which is insane obviously the brands know they're throwing the event so like i just don't understand why it's like so last minute um actually the shop style thing was not last minute but create and cultivate i was gonna go anyways but they were just like i'll just get you in fast tracked so that's why we were able to cut the line and it was so so clutch like very nice that they let my friends in too so we'll do the create and cultivate bag first this hat is so freaking cute you guys know i'm a sucker for a trucker hat and the smiley it's adorable so very excited to wear that i had like a navy blue option i think i thought it was black but i think i saw it in the sun it was kind of like blue so glad i got the tan even though i have like literally <laughs> so many tan hats okay hydrating cream from community 66 I have my seltzer some goodies from um v magic them in a wash okay we have some shetties they like stocked this up so well we have little wipes i guess this is just some more lotion sunscreen i feel like it's just like a lot of skincare products brightening serum all these brands are like very new to me i don't think i've um seen these brands before didn't realize you couldn't see it way too bright sorry okay let's see what's inside oh okay tampons <laughs> oh my gosh also i saw jonathan van ness at last night's event i don't think i told you guys very cool because i went to his event last year um toothpaste design me gloss me hair serum this looks very nice they said it was like 400 dollars worth of products in here two minute conditioning glaze from dp hue literally going to put this in some water right now it's electrolytes i am about to explode my mind is about to explode this is an essential oil okay let's do this big thing i have no idea Ooh, a floaty that's so cute i wish i had oh wait well i guess i have a pool in my apartment complex but like honestly we used to live at a more family complex not even family but just like older people and now we definitely live at more of a younger crowd complex so i used to be able to play mermaids in the swimming pool and now i have to like look cool while drinking a white claw and it kind of sucks so i don't know if a tube would like be weird <laughs> um i know exactly what this is packed party i didn't see it from a damn mile away Ooh, detoxifying oxygen facial mask that is interesting what <gasps> shut up we got tinks we got tinks's collab that is really cool because apparently this was like limited, I think. Avocado jalapeno hot sauce. Ryan's gonna love that. That is really cool. That might be my favorite thing in the bag. Ooh. Okay. We got some wine. Love that. Ooh, I see something yellow. Super goop. Hell yeah. We have an everyday lotion. I love super goop. Biosance squalene vitamin C rose oil. <gasps> yes, I love it face oils and all of that kind of stuff how cute it's funny because some of these events that i'm going to later tonight i wasn't originally invited but then i like reached out to the brand and was like hey i'm an austin based blogger and was wondering if you have any events they were pretty quick to respond and they were able to get me on the list which is so exciting and honestly that is where my favorite quote comes in the worst answer you can get is no you should always like try and ask because you never know i mean you literally never know these people want free promo anyways and when i was at create and cultivate i overheard people saying oh she's a paid media influencer i was like hmm, maybe i should be charging for this but honestly i'm just so happy to go to the events and just experience it so like i'm fine for now i think definitely the people that have gone to so many south buys is like probably just like so you know old at this point that they're like okay i'm just gonna do it if i'm getting paid which totally makes sense but i just think it's so fun to go to all these events and i'm actually meeting a couple of you guys so shout out to you guys if you say hi i appreciate it and if you do see me out and have like a resting bitch face that is just 
how I look on a daily basis, unfortunately. So don't be scared to come up to me and say hi, like ever, seriously. I don't mind it and I would love if you guys said hi. I feel like I get messages sometimes and they'll be like, oh, I saw you in Austin like last weekend. I didn't want to say hi. I'm like, literally why? I'm so sorry if I scared you with my resting bitch face. I really don't want to redo my makeup, but it just looks so gross like under my eyes. It looks like so splotchy because um, I was like sweating, but later tonight it's gonna be dark anyway so i'm like is it even worth it like i feel like from far away in camera you can't really tell unless you can i'm sorry that you have to witness this but i just really don't want to have to do anything else i just want to sit right here drink my ele electrolytes i'm gonna drink a lot of water because i need to hydrate and chill and like post some stories and to like catch up with that and i'm gonna do day in my life on TikTok. So if you guys are not already following me on TikTok, go ahead and do so and check out all my South by Southwest content over there. We've changed for our evening events and I think, well, the first one's at Ellen's Boots. So I got my cowboy boots on, but they're to go bus, but oh well. <laughs> um, and then we have a TikTok party, which I feel like we'll probably end on that just because it's kind of closer to us so we can like go back home and then stop there on the way. And we also have like a group love concert hosted by Amazon Prime and Essie. Both brands invited me and I said yes to both brands. I don't really know how that works. We are about to head out to go to South Congress. Here's my evening outfit. The dress is from Z Supply and I feel like it's perfect because it's so freaking hot outside. And then boots, I told you guys, they're from Tacovas. They are definitely coming to Nashville with me. I can't believe it. We're leaving on Thursday. Ryan just went shopping today, apparently. You went to Nordstrom Rack, huh? Mm-hmm. He was like contemplating his hat for the last 15 minutes. Three minutes. I'm being dramatic, yeah. <laughs> okay, where's your fit from? This is aloe. Yes, cute. These are, I think, good fellow from Target. Cute. And then Tom's. Shoes. I should be wearing my rainbows, huh? No, no flippy flops. Happy Sunday, it is South by Southwest day three. And I'm actually starting off the morning really, really early. It is 8, 16, technically it's 7, 16 because today daylight savings happened. So that's exciting. We'll have a lot more sun and the sun will set at 7.30 or 7.40 today. That'll be really nice, but I feel like every time this happens, like every year, I'm like, what do I do with this extra hour of light? Like, I'm just like, wait, I want it to be dark now because I'm so used to it. For me, I feel like if the sun is out, I should be filming and like taking advantage, doing TikToks, like filming anything I can. The fall time is actually better for just like balancing everything because I know when the sun sets, I'm turning off things and like maybe just like posting, not filming, but we'll work on it. Um, this morning I have a engagement session if you guys don't know i'm a photographer here in austin and we are doing it in front of the gorgeous austin skyline literally we can all have asked for a better sunrise it is so pretty out it is also 64 degrees i think the humidity is like a little bit high but not nearly as bad as what i have been dealing with with my grads because i don't know it's just been so humid and hazy in the mornings not ideal for hair especially if they have frizzy hair but um i just parked at the bat observation parking lot or like that statesman journal place um and i'm waiting on my clients <laughs> Here is our next location. Look at this freaking view. Holy crap. It's so good. It's pretty windy out today, which sucks. Home 
did a really quick outfit change and did my hair in a slick back because it's just one of those days. My shoot went so well. I'm already like uploading the photos and everything, multitasking. But this is the outfit. This shirt is from Revolve. Jeans are Zara. New balances. Let's go to our first event of South by Southwest day three. So we are going to an HBO Max White Lotus panel kind of thing. And I think that they have free food. I haven't eaten yet, so I'm very hungry. Loaded up. Croissants, frittatas, fruits, meat. <laughs> is a social media wizard. Evan, thank you for, for being here. Thank you. So, uh, I think everybody here is uh, hopefully familiar with the White Lotus and also the White Lotus as a phenomenon on social media. We just left HBO Max Coffee House. They started their panel pretty late, so we were waiting for a while, but brunch was good. And I met a new friend because Ryan was in the bathroom. This girl was like, is anyone sitting here? And I was like, no. And then I started making conversation. And she is so sweet. Her name's Asia. And I also saw my friend Kayla, which was nice. She sat next to us for a little bit. My new friend Asia lives in LA. And I'm planning to go to California soon. So I was like, let me know. What are all the fun, cool things to do? So I feel like I'm out of the loop. I'm still like, El Ponte's cool. I feel like it's still cool. The food was really good, yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna have to go back to El Monte for sure. Um, but I think I'm gonna take a little break. Ryan has to go to the airport, unfortunately. Get back, so. Yeah, true. I took a little bit of a breather when I came home and got a five minute nap in. I think it barely felt like even five minutes, but it's okay. It's something. Um, and then I had to drive Ryan to the airport because he's actually going to a work conference this week, so he left today. And now I'm going to meet up with the people from TikTok. So I'm really excited about that. Um, I'm wearing Abercrombie jeans, Abercrombie, no, wait, is this mesh key? I feel like this is mesh key, but I feel like Abercrombie probably has something similar. Same old New Balances. These are really getting me through this weekend. Just trying to be as comfortable as I can. I'm about to call my Uber to go meet with the girls. And then after that, we're gonna do like a happy hour event and hopefully meet some of my friends there. I decided to switch the jeans for some light blue jeans and some mules or clogs, whatever we want to call them. Here at the TikTok house with the TikTok shop girls. Hi! We're so excited for TikTok shop to launch soon. Um, it's definitely a very exciting opportunity for our creators to earn extra money on TikTok. So definitely. We are at the She Media event here with my friend Mackenzie. All of the stuff, I think. Uh, yes. well, free wine. I got prosecco. What you get? Uh, Pinot Gris. You know. to white wine because they ran out of Prosecco. We're gonna go take a photo on this cute wall over here. Oh, good pitch. Yes. Good. Here's the accountability for rugby. We are getting ice cream. The world. We're raising awareness for companies that don't follow through. There's a nice little pregame with ice cream. We just got free ice cream. Ben and Jerry's. I'm gonna get the booze. Boozy. Heebie-jeebie. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know that's how heebie is spelled. I didn't think. It is only. Oh, that is interesting. I definitely. I've didn't. never seen it written out. I've I was thinking like, E's, not I's. I think it is E's and not I's. Oh, maybe they got it wrong here. But yeah. I am like gonna throw a bit that they don't have the number five. It goes from four to six. Like oh. they already know they fucked up. And <laughs> <laughs> that's so weird.
I realized I didn't end this vlog and wanted to do a quick outro. I hope you guys enjoyed this South by Southwest vlog and it does not end here because it goes through this coming week and then the next weekend, but I'll be in Nashville next weekend. So get pumped for that vlog. If you guys want to see real time content, you can go on my Instagram or my TikTok at so underscore gnarly without the G. I post a lot of Austin content over there. So if you guys are new to Austin or if you're visiting Austin, I have a lot of Instagram highlights for food, drinks, sweet treats, like anything you can imagine. I also have a TikTok playlist and a YouTube playlist with all my Austin vlogs. If you're not subscribed, make sure you do so and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.